The Compendium of Materia Medica, also known by the romanizations Ben Sao Gang Mu or Pen Tsao Kang Mu, is a Chinese herbology volume written by Li Shizhen during the Ming Dynasty. Its first draft was completed in 1578. It is a work epitomizing the Materia Medica known at the time. The Compendium of Materia Medica is regarded as the most complete and comprehensive medical book ever written in the history of traditional Chinese medicine. It lists all the plants, animals, minerals, and other items that were believed to have medicinal properties. The text consists of 1,892 entries, each entry with its own name called a gang. The mu in the title refers to the synonyms of each name. The British historian of Chinese science Joseph Needham calls Li Shizhen the uncrowned king of Chinese naturalists, and his Ben Sao Gang Mu, undoubtedly the greatest scientific achievement of the Ming. Topic <laughs> name. The title, translated as, "...materia medica, arranged according to drug descriptions and technical aspects," uses two Chinese compounds, bensao roots and herbs, based on herbs, pharmacopoeia, materia medica, combines ben, pen, ben root, origin, basis and cow, tsao, cow grass, plant, herb. Gangmu, Kang Mu, detailed outline, table of contents combines Gang, Kang, Gang main rope, Horsa, main threads, essential principles, and Mu, Mu I, look, category, division. The characters Gang and Mu were later used as class and order, respectively, in biological classification. Topic: History. Li Shizhen completed the first draft of the text in 1578, after conducting readings of 800 other medical reference books and carrying out 30 years of field study. For this and many other achievements, Li Shizhen is compared to Shenong, a god in Chinese mythology who gave instruction on agriculture and herbal medicine. Content The Compendium of Materia Medica has 53 volumes in total. At the very beginning is the Table of Contents, containing a list of entries included and 1,160 hand-drawn diagrams to serve as illustrations. Volume 1 to 4 An Index and a comprehensive list of herbs that would treat the most common sickness. Baibing Zhuji Volume 5 to 53 The main content of the text, containing 1,892 distinct herbs, of which 374 were added by Li himself. There are 11,096 side prescriptions to treat common illness, 8,160 of which is compiled or collected by Li. The text is written in almost 2 million Chinese characters, classified into 16 divisions and 60 orders. For every herb, there are entries on their names, a detailed description of their appearance and odor, nature, medical function, effects, and side recipes, etc. Topic. Value With the publication of Compendium of Materia Medica, not only did it improve the classification of how traditional medicine was compiled and formatted, but it was also an important medium in improving the credibility and scientific values of biology classification of both plants and animals. The compendium corrected many mistakes and misapprehensions of the nature of herbs and diseases. Li also included many new herbs, adding his own discoveries of particular drugs and their efficacy and function, as well as more detailed descriptions of the results of experiments. It also has notes and records on general medical data and medical history. 
Compendium of Materia Medica is also more than a mere pharmaceutical text, for it includes a vast amount of information on topics as wide-ranging as biology, chemistry, geography, mineralogy, geology, history, and even mining and astronomy, which might appear to have little connection with herbal medicine. It has been translated into more than 20 languages and spread all over the world. Even now it is still in print and used as a reference book. Errors Compendium of Materia Medica also contains information that has since been proven to be erroneous due to the contemporary limited scientific and technical knowledge. For example, it is claimed that lead is not toxic. It is also claimed that otters are always male, and that the Mopan langa is 10 feet tall, has backwards feet, and can be caught when it draws its upper lip over its eyes. Topic: <laughs> Popular culture. Compendium of Materia Medica is the title of a song performed by the Taiwanese singer Jay Chu in his album Still Fantasy. The lyrics discuss Chinese pride and make references to aspects of Chinese herbal medicine. See also Chinese herbology Mellified man Pharmacognosy Yaoxing Lun